Brother. Brother, what is it? Why are you like this? How can you get in there, Brother. Brother, see, sobbing like this all the time cannot solve our predicament. It cannot. We have to stand like men and look for solution to us, whatever. Eh? Do you want to kill yourself? Eh? Of what use is life? Eh? Of what use is life with a lot of tribulations, a lot of stress, a lot of trouble pushing us down? Every now and then, Tony, if I say I am not tired and confused, I am a liar. Brother. I am confused. Why? Why do we face so much trouble in this, in this life? Brother, eh? brother that please see, you have to take it easy. Eh? Brother, stop talking like this. You're still very vibrant. And you have me by your side. Okay? Perhaps. Brother, brother, listen. We are going to and we must make this money and shame the devil and all our enemies. <laughs> Tony, did you visit our job for treatment today? Make which money? Brother, it's, it's eh? is, is money making on your chow? On your chow, where you go? You could run here on our beer. No, this is not funny. Like I said, I'm not joking. Okay. Okay, do you know what? Hmm? I have a plan. You have a plan? Yes. Tony. Right, so have been trampled upon. We have been humiliated beyond measures. Poverty. 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 What have you not done to me? What have you not done to us? Father, wherever you are, rise up. Rise up and fight! Fight! Fight for your children! Get that which belongs to your children. We can't continue suffering like this. Who told you that the dead fight? Once dead, is forever dead. Only the living fights the battle for their destiny. Let us fight this poverty to a definite end. And please, drop this, this, drop this superstitious belief that amounts to nothing. And let's take our destiny into our hands. Please. For once, Tony, I, I, I believe you. Once I agree with you. Hey, Obiam. Obiam, I'm not me, man. We do it. That's a nice decision. It's you and it's your man. Finally, nice decision, my brother. And now that you've made up your mind, are you already inquired before now? Kinsley, welcome. Okay, Kiwi. We'll make it. Tony, Tony, and Tony, one Nemo. How many times did I call you, brother? I've told you to trust me. Just trust me. Huh? Mm. Trust me. Let's go. And Tony, the washo. Be sure. No, 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 no. One kid has to go and if he had a new mammy, they were new queen, we can go home on the GB. If I didn't get a boy, you know, are you sure? Enjoy. Let's go. Enjoy. 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 Be there, you can't enjoy. Manoqua. I can take a bullet for you. I can do anything for you. I can go anywhere for you. You my only family. I'll sacrifice everything for you. I can give my life for you. 
Brother, please don't get tired. Eh? We will soon get there. Don't, don't get tired. Tony, I'm, I'm... You know, nothing good comes easy. Don't get tired. We're almost there. Tony, I'm beginning to have strange feelings. Oh. Strange feelings. Seriously. Eh? Strange feelings. Qua. See, brother, I, I, I've been here before. That's why I'm guiding you. We will soon get there. Eh? Tony, I'm going to eat more than you. Nobody's going to eat you. We've gone so far that we cannot chicken out now. Hmm? Let's go. Let's go now. Okay. Let's go. Tony. See. <laughs> 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 The great Obajala has had your petitions, but there is a problem. What problem? Making money will not be possible for the two of you. Something happened to your destiny in your previous incarnation, which affects your present existence. And until this spell of setback, which links you with that previous incarnation, is broken, you can never make money, you can never be rich, no matter what you do. This is a curse beyond your mortal comprehension. Uh, um, uh, uh. Wise one, we are here already, and we cannot go back without achieving our aim. That's why we are here to seek for your help at all costs. Great one, there is no problem in life without a solution. How can we break through this curse? Huh? You have just asked a very crucial question. And that shows that both of you came prepared. children, I can see a very dark cloak covering your destinies. And this cloak is the reason your stars cannot shine brightly. And until it is completely destroyed, you cannot make progress. However, you can still make money rituals and become very rich. Oh, great one. We can do anything to make money. Anything. And I'm ready to sacrifice a human blood. Wait! Hey. Huh? Do not put words into Obadjala's mouth. He does not require your human blood. He is merciful and kind. He does not ask for too much. You can make money rituals without human blood, but there are little deeper sacrifices. 
just like Ubajala requires of you. Hmm. Only the young men be able to do. Now, as you can be robo. One of you must sacrifice his destiny for the other to be rich. Wise one. Mm -hmm. Is that the only demand? Yes. In that case, I'm willing to sacrifice my destiny for my brother to shine out. I will do that. No, Tony. Great one, I am his elder brother. I will sacrifice my destiny. No. Let me do it. No, I will do it, Tony. Let me do it Tony, for you. I will do it for us. Great one. Please, I am going to do it. No, no, great one. Tony, don't, don't get me angry before the, the great one. I am your elder brother. I promise our father to protect you always. Great, great one. Take my sacrifice. Take it. Allow me to do it. Allow me. Tony, Enough! Money ritual cannot work unless the two of you are great. Therefore, you must go, think, decide, and come back to me as one. Well. No, no, wise one. We have decided, we have made up our minds. Just, just do what you, say what you want us to do and then let's... Eh? Go, think about it, and come back to me in the next market day, when you are ready. Stop that, that you say. Eh? I, I, why not your elder brother? I'm the one that is supposed to do it. Thank you, as one. As one, you may your days be long. I love your room, no. I didn't hear my men be a menu. What is wrong with you? Even in Mickey. Eh? But this has been my idea from onset. Hey brother, why must you do that? Because of what you did now, the, 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 the chief priest asked us to go back and make a decision. Why must you do that now, brother? Tony, shut up. Shut up. What do you know about sacrifice and destiny? Listen, I am your elder brother. What I do for myself, I do for you too, Tony. Brother, no. No! You should have allowed me to make the sacrifice. You should have allowed me to sacrifice my destiny. Brother. I cannot allow you to sacrifice your destiny. <sighs> Tony. Listen, if you actually want us to do this, I will sacrifice my destiny instead of you. Brother, don't say that. Don't say that. Don't be, be, it's because of what you did that's made us to, 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 be, to be bounced back by the chief priest because of our indiscretion. How are you talking like a coward? Are you mad? Are you senseless? How dare you label me a, a coward? Because I'm, 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 I'm trying to consider you. Brother, you slapped me. Brother, you, 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 strapped, you slapped me? Because I was trying to, I was trying to avoid us from poverty. You had to go to slap me, brother. I am, I'm the only family you have here. I'm, 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 I'm your sibling. I am your blood. I'm all that you have. Okay, were you enjoying all the embarrassment? All the, all the... Brother, you slapped me because of this, why? I'm sorry, brother. I'm sorry, I... From the depth of my heart, I didn't mean to hurt you. All our lives have been your strength. And you're my courage, Tony. Huh? Then you Then allow me to sacrifice my destiny for you. I want you to be happy, brother. No, Tony, no. I promised, I promised our father to protect you. And until now, I will still do that. Tony, trust my judgment. Trust my judgment. You're my true brother. I am your elder brother. Let me lead my example, please. That's my brother. Oh. So finally, fate has brought us to a crossroad. 
how can we be faced with such an outrageous option? That is what uncontrollable desire for wealth can lead someone into. Only if Tony had discussed this with me earlier before taking address from whosoever that misled him into this difficult mission. Why did I even agree to sojourn with him to an unknown place? What if we were close to getting our breakthrough from God? Hey, impatience. Impatience. Impatience is a, is, is a disease. Now we have already opened a page with the devil and what we started, we must finish, no matter what. Once in, there is absolutely no going back. But Tony is the younger one. He should let me do this. This boy is too stubborn. How I wish he's the type that understands. How do I convince him to allow me to do this? Eh? This is another hard, hard nut to crack. My late father warned me and I promised him I would take care of him. Are you for real? After all the stress at the farm. Well, eh? I needed to wash. And you, uh, that should be my clothes. It's your clothes, huh? Ah, that's good. That's very thoughtful of you. It's okay, Papa. Mm. I didn't want to disturb you when I was going. What of your brother, Tony? Uh, Papa, well, I just found a song that people can hear. But I, I call it old Tony to forget about it. But he insisted. So this morning he went to confront the man. Even all my effort to make sure that peace reigns in this family, he went ahead. Oh, eh? my. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. But again, there is this doubt I'm having about Tony. Doubt? Honestly. Uh, Kingsley, hmm? you are very peaceful. I've been able to compare you and your brother Tony. Oh. You are patient and very peaceful, and you are very meticulous. Look at what you are doing. Huh? But your brother Tony, that one is so careless. He's too careless. Huh? He has this careless attitude to everything. And he ventures into things without even giving it a second thought. That is not good, my son. You have a duty to perform for me, my son. No, Papa, do you want to sit? No, no, to sit. Oh, don't oh, worry. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Slay, you have a duty to perform for me. From the look of things, your brother is your direct opposite. Do me one favor. Protect him. Whenever he goes stray, guide him. He's not like you. My son, even when I join my ancestors, promise me, my son, that you're going to do this. Papa Tony is my younger brother. Yes, and it is my sole duty to protect him, whether you ask me or not. Anyways, I, I heard you and I will, I will do as you have just advised. I will protect him. God bless you, my son. <coughs> God bless you. Well, you were talking about joining ancestors. So you are not dying now. Papa, we, we, we are here together. I'm not going anywhere. I know. I'm not even prepared to die now, my son. Mm -hmm. But one, somebody must go someday. Uh, let mm -hmm. that someday come, not <laughs> now. Oh? Because, because if you do this for me, God will bless you. Well, oh? Have you eaten today? Uh, this is too much for me to bear. Too much for me to bear. Hi. How do I go about this? Brother, I do not want you to bother yourself so much. I already have everything well planned. Okay? I am going to call the shot while you follow. Remember, 
We have an appointment with the chief priest by tomorrow being Upomake Day. He asked us to reach to a resolution. I wouldn't want us to argue about this. I am going to be the one to sacrifice. No, Tony. Tony. Tony, listen, our father's demise has made me the head of the family. Why don't you follow my lead? Eh? Allow me to do this thing. After all, it's the same thing. Brother, no. Let me be the one to sacrifice. Please. Ah. Let me do this. Tony, you're too stubborn. That is a problem. Eh, is it very hard for you to understand that I am your elder brother and then just listen to me for once? Oh, okay, okay. Since you do not want to consent to, to, to whatever I am saying, no problems. Brother. Next in Market Day, the chief priest asked us to come. Okay? Yes. I will not follow you. Brother. If you want this, if you want this to happen, I'll, then listen to me. Allow me to do it. Or I will not follow you. Then let us brother, uh, fa brother, fa brother. face the consequences. Brother, together. we've gone so far to give up now. Don't you understand? Then listen to me. Brother, listen. Listen. listen brother. No, no, you listen. Our destiny lies in this. Understand me. Ah. I would have loved to be the one to do this, but since you don't want me to do, do it, I, 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 I give up. I give up, brother. Better. Better, brother, please. Brother. I, I will always love you. I will never forget this. Okay? Thank you for doing this. Thank you so much. I will never ever forget it. You are my only beloved brother. The younger one at that. It is my utmost priority to make you happy. It is my priority to protect you, Tony. I promised our father. And that is what I am doing. Tomorrow. Shall go. <laughs> That's my brother. That's my Thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate it. Uh, you be a small boy. My name will be. Yeah, but I can go see your your petitions to Bajala as I told you to recite in the past three days. Today is the day of rituals. Speak for Bajala is listening. Bajala, the, the giver of riches and wealth, I, Tonsili Omuka, plead with you to bless us to the shock and surprise of those who make mockery of us, and we shall forever remain indebted to you. Bajala has heard your petitions. Now we shall proceed with the rituals proper. Follow me. Brave men. You have completed the rituals. Your wealth, great wealth, shall be from generation to generation. It can never end. But remember all the instructions that I gave you. This is not a sacrifice of blood, but of love. Therefore, love is the key and the pillar. Again, do not stay away from each other for more than three nights. Three. Finally, the secrets of your wealth must remain your secrets alone. No other ear must hear about it. Go and enjoy your wealth. Thank you, great one. Thank you, great one.
I can take a bullet for you I can do anything for you I can go anywhere for you You my only family I'll sacrifice everything for you I can give my life for you You are all I've got You are all that is left you are my only brother, my only brother, my only family, my only brother. You are my only brother, my only brother, my only family, my only brother. And no one's gonna stop the love we share Everything I have, I swear I your own no And anywhere I go, you come with me We've sacrificed a lot for one another And nothing will come in between us Oh, my brother, my only brother You are my only brother my only brother, my only family, my only blood, you are my only brother. My only brother. You guys coming? My only Excuse brother. me, sir. Yeah, what is it? There is somebody at the reception that wants to see you. Okay, what is his name? <laughs> he refused to say his name. Right? He, I don't know, he's just being stubborn. Should I call the security on him? You should have done that already. Okay. Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay. It's okay, it's okay. 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 It's Okay? Alright, sir. Thank I'm you. I'm really sorry, sir. Please. Oh, no, you can go now. One more. I started one. Okay, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Chief Executive Officer, T and K Associates Limited. One more. ATM machine. One more. I'm going to borrow this company. Go one. Okay, go now. One more. I I uh, go a little junta junta. Plus, uh, I'm a man. I like yeah, you. Yeah, you know, you know why? Eh? You made it happen. I know. Yeah, you <laughs> made it happen. C E O. C E O. One of them. ATM machine. I want to now we go one. Of this company. I want to make. I want to have a real real fire. Come on, give me, give me some drinks there. Be a man. Ma, this one is. This one is twenty thousand naira. This one is forty thousand naira. This one is fifty. This one is sixty. And this beautiful one is forty thousand naira, ma. Okay, let me have this. The one of forty thousand. Okay. okay. Have you seen what you like? Yes, I think I like this. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. All right. Cash or POS? POS. Current or savings? Current. Your pin. Thank you. All right. Thank 
you. That's your receipt. Alright, thank you. Please bring it. Let me pack for you. Okay, help her. No, no, no. Put the sunglasses inside the pack. Thank you. Thank you very much. Please make sure you patronize us always. Though. You know our things are very original and quite affordable. Don't forget to always come. Oh. You know our things are authentic and very affordable. Trace you, and here we are. You know, mm, that's so thoughtful of you. Thank you so much. It's, it's right. no. How is your brother Tony? Well, he's he's good, doing well as well. Uh -huh. How now? I'm fine, sir. Uh, my is colleague Chine. Oh wow, mm. nice. My yeah. friend from the village, Onyobu. <laughs> <laughs> nice meeting you. Anyways. Yeah. So, how is your friend uh, Christabel? Christabel is now in the city with me, but unfortunately, she hasn't gotten a job yet. It's not been long she left. Oh really? Yes. Wow, nice. You, you guys have a very good place. You? Thank you. My madam is a rich woman. Now. Don't worry, she will soon be back. I will introduce you to her. I missed you, mama. Please <laughs> sit down. What's that your size again? Okay, I know I haven't forgotten. I'm 41. Gone. And I know Saturday. Mm -hmm. you, mama. That was how we made it through our friend who set us up with a huge amount of and the rest is history. <laughs> hmm. That guy is an angel in human form. May God bless him. May God reward him abundantly. Amen. 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 Congratulations. Your man. Hey, money looks good on you, my friend. Hey. Maybe let's round up so we can. Are you serious? No. You need to see the guy again. Eh? He is looking very too rich, big and cute. Hey, Kuzibana, is you? Hey! Put on him again. Hmm. Kiss him. Hey! You are doing well, though. Ah, let me call him. Who is this? Going up on me for now. Yes? Who is this? I love you more. Hey. <laughs> okay. You will come and see us over the weekend. He's coming over the weekend. <laughs> we, can't, we can't wait to see you. Hmm? Greet your brother for me. Kiss me. I'm going to take care. Huh? I love you. Bye. <clears throat> love is sweeter. <laughs> but when money enters, love is sweeter. <laughs> 
see the way he's sounding over the phone. Him and one way kato on DJ go see her. Say Ada. Oh, one way go. That is it. Cheers. Yes, to good life. Yes, to good life. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Whoo! God is good. All the time. <laughs> I mean, this is reality. This is happening for real. I am so happy. I am so, so, so very happy. Finally, God united us in prosperity, not poverty, like before. <laughs> God is good. See, God is good. I'm so happy that God has blessed us with so much, you know, mm -hmm. to marry, drink, mm -hmm. and talk. Uh -huh. I'm happy for two of you. Thank God for giving you guys prosperity. Thank God for giving all of us life. Because yes. if we don't have life, we won't be here celebrating. Yes. 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 That's good. <sighs> Life is good though. Life is good. And God is good. And God is good. You marry me? I can take a bullet for you I can do anything for you I can go anywhere for you You my only family I'll sacrifice everything for you I can give my life for you You are all I've got You are all that is left you are my only brother, my only brother, my only family, my only brother. You are my only brother, my only brother, my only family, my only And no one's gonna stop the love we share Everything I have, I swear I own it now And anywhere I go, you come with me I, We've sacrificed a lot for one another And nothing will come in between us Oh, my brother, my only brother You are my only brother my only brother, my only family, my only blood, you are my only brother, my only brother, my only family. Hey. Oh.
Good morning, honey. Good morning, my love. You're awake. Yes. How are you? Hope you slept well. Yeah, sure. Did you? Of course I did. Mm -hmm. With my darling by my side. Uh -huh. There's no way I won't sleep well. I know. Um, baby, there's something I'd like to discuss with you. Okay. Remember you told me I should let you know whenever I'm ready to start my own business? Mm -hmm. Of course. I'm ready. Okay. Yes, I desire to own a classic boutique. You know, I worked with my madam, so I already have the experience and customer base. All I need is money because it's quite capital intensive. Okay, nice. So, how much are we talking about here? 20 million naira. All right, all right, no problems. I've heard you. But um, I'll discuss it with my brother before he goes out for work. Hmm? You would discuss with your brother? Yes, of course, so that he will make the money available for you. So must you take permission from your brother before you do anything? If I ask you for money, you tell me you will talk to your brother. If I ask you for anything, you tell me it's becoming boring and irritating. Honey, listen, my brother and I are so close. We are so united that no one does anything without consulting another. That's not true. You act like a second-hand citizen in this house. I've never seen him consult you before giving money to his wife. I've never seen him consult you before taking decisions. You are the only one going to him, your younger brother. Well, I am sorry if you feel bad about this, but the truth is we are just, we are just so close. All right, and the most important thing that you get the 20 million naira. <laughs> Honey, cheer up, all right? You get the money. Come here. I'm not happy with all this. I'm not happy, and I don't want to keep pretending about it. It's becoming irritating. As a young married couple, we don't have secrets. Everything about us, you must say to your brother. Everything, if anything, we cannot even do anything. We don't have our own lives. Baby, stop. The most important thing is that he will concur when I talk to him. Ah, you need him to concur, right? Secondhand citizen. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, come. Come, mama. Please leave me. Come here. Come here. <laughs> It's not fun. Give me a You know how to be somebody. Hey, babe. Hey, babe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who is calling me? Uh, okay, baby. Yes. There's a seminar coming up in Abuja. All the board of directors and all the stakeholders will be attending it, and um, we are invited as usual. Oh my goodness, this is nice, this is good. In Abuja, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Perfect. You remember my friend Jane? Oh, Jane? My childhood friend? Oh, yeah, Jane, yeah, 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 yeah. She has been inviting me to Abuja. Oh, for real? Yes, and this is the perfect time to visit her when we go on the trip. Mm. Oh, I can't wait. Baby, I am <laughs> Let sorry. Let me chat her up. Sorry to disappoint you, you won't be going with me. Why? Oh, your brother, as usual, right? Uh, baby, you know, I, I, I really need to go with my brother. I don't understand this. Honestly, I don't get it. You want to take your brother, who is a novice, to a business uh, trip? Baby, baby, baby. No, 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 allow me to talk, please. I am the MD of the company. You're supposed to go with me. This is an official trip. But no, you prefer to go with your brother. Who is a novice? Baby, you're the MD and that's why I wanted to stay back and take care of the official affairs here. Tony, Me? what is this? What is going on? What is this obsession with your brother? Is he your handbag? Is he your wife? What is this? B baby. What is going on? Is there something you're not telling me? No, baby. See, I just want you to understand, you know? Kinsley has nothing to do with He's so no. bored at home. So I need to take him around, show him places, get him to, into business, for him to get something doing and, 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 and get busy. You know what I mean? You know, I, I believe you understand. Okay? Babe, babe, babe. Babe, come on, come on, see. Okay, I promise you when I come back, I'm going to take you on a wonderful trip, on a beautiful trip, we'll go to somewhere so beautiful and then, you know, 
catch phone and enjoy yourself. Okay, I'm gonna get you a designers. What kind of designers do you want? Gucci, uh, um, Burberry, and uh, I know what you like. Huh? Come on, come on. Hey, bro. Hi. What's up, man? I'm good. Uh, did you get my test? Yes, I got it. Uh, I've already done it. Yeah, I mean, we're talking about money to set up your wife's business here. Yeah. And I hope it's going to be enough. Well, that's what she asked for. It's okay. Yeah. And that reminds me, we're going to Abuja for the workshop by next week. Again? Yeah. Tony, we were in Port Harcourt last week. <laughs> it's not as if I even understand what you guys are doing. <laughs> Bro, just take it easy, okay? I don't want my wife to hear your complaint, okay? And, uh, you know, she's on my neck now. I, I dropped her off to go with you. I just wish you have a choice. Yeah, but it's just for three days. There's no choice. Well, meanwhile, why are you patronizing her? Because we went for, uh, what's it called? A business trip. Does she know Kaisi Gwadu? Huh? Oma Kaisi Gwadu? You don't do that, huh? I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Married to themselves. <laughs> it's not funny. Babe, oh, honestly, it's not. Of course it is, because it's something I've been complaining about. I don't have option than to get used to it. So what exactly happened this time around? Okay. I was supposed to embark on a business trip with my husband. But no, he prefers to go with his brother. Really? Yes. My darling. You just have to get used to it. As a matter of fact, I share in this pain. Because my husband will also not be here. I'll be here alone missing him. Till they are back from the trip. So my darling, get used to it. Yes. Oh. Mm. Get used to it, please, and be happy. I'll try. I'll be try. Happy. Be happy. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I heard that you're about opening your boutique. Oh, these brothers cannot even keep a secret. <laughs> yes, I want to own a classic boutique, an exquisite, expensive luxury boutique. That's my but you know what? Yeah. You'll be my first client. Aww, I'm, honored. First <laughs> I'm honored. I'm <laughs> honored. I just told him this morning, I'm, I'm surprised he has told your husband already. These brothers. Like you don't know, your proposal must pass through secret consultation. Or should I say, <laughs> a panel of judges. No! House of Assembly. No, House of Assembly. Well, it's fine. You know, it's men's world, so we just have to endure. I know. I know. Please, let me check what's going on. Oh, quickly, really? before it gets gone. All right. Oh, uh, what's up? What's popping? Aha, please, um, Mr. Bell, please help me and get a new paper, this one. I want a paper. I, I bought paper for you yesterday. Well, this one is old. Buy me two days old. All right. Please tell my husband that I've gone to the market. Take care. This is becoming annoying and alarming. How can an able-bodied man that is well-educated be totally idle from January to December, from week to week, and from month to month? Someone that is educated though, 
the most appalling aspect of this nonsense is that Tony, my husband, does not see anything wrong with it. The company my husband is running is established with the combination of their names, which means that he has every right to occupy any position he wants. But no! Why then make the choice to stay idle? At least his wife is about laying her hands on something. He really needs to be called to order, honestly. Open the gate. Yes, ma. I can take a bullet for you. I can do anything for you. I can go anywhere for you. You my only family. I'll sacrifice everything for you. I can give my life for you. You are all I've got. You are all that is left. You are my only brother. My only brother. My only family. My only brother. You are my own. My only brother, my only family, my only love. We are inseparable, and no one's gonna stop the love we share. Everything I have, I swear I your own now. And anywhere I go, you come with me. I we've sacrificed a lot for one another. This is almost two years of my matrimonial experience with you. And I must confess, it has been great. You're a good man, caring, loving, and very generous. You have employed more than 20 of my friends. And you have assisted my brother Emeka, severally in his business. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're welcome. But darling, what I don't understand is why your brother Kinsley stays at home every day without doing nothing. I mean... Why are you unnecessary to forward in everything? Why? Am I? Mm -hmm. Darling, is there something attached to this? I mean, is there something you're not telling me? How can a grown man, a graduate for that matter, enjoy idling around? Sitting at home, doing nothing. Am I complaining? I'm not complaining. That is his life. It's not yours, neither mine. So why are you crying more than the bereaved? I am complaining. Yes, because I am now part of your family. Someone needs to call your brother to order. Someone needs to talk to him. Maybe an elder. Maybe he thinks what he's doing is right. Unfortunately, you are not an elder. And you're the least person expected to pray into such discussion. So leave my brother to bother about that. Yeah. Tony, why do you always make me look like a fool each time I come for us to reason like man and wife? Why? Because your suggestion is always out of point and they may gossip to discuss about people. Christopher, please, 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 I've been very busy, man. If you do not have something reasonable to say here, please do the honorable thing. Tony, mm -hmm. are you indirectly ordering me out of your office? Christopher, see, please, you're distracting and disturbing me. I have no answer to your question, okay? As you can see, I want to get busy.
Bro, what is it? Your mood is not good and I've not seen you like this before. What is the matter? Your wife, Christabel, is the matter. Uh, but, 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 brother, my wife did what? Your wife insulted. Then, then, eh? If I'm one your wife had the gut to insult me today. Your wife rained insults on me today. What? Ah. Um, um, brother, please. Please, do not take it serious, okay? Do not take it to heart. No, you can imagine. You can oh? imagine. My wife said all that to you? <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. What did I do? Excuse me. Huh? What did I do? 